There we go, we're live. That was a bit of a pain, but we got there in the end. Looks good to me. Yeah, everything looks good. One, two, one, two. Right. Took a bit of doing, but we got there. Let's just go high. <laughs> yeah, that should do it. Right. What the game? Uh, go to dashboard, just stream. Turn that one off. Spare with me. Too many things going now. Wait a minute. Don't want that. Don't want that. Don't want that one. And I don't want that one. Right. Okay. That's looking not too bad. Yeah. It's doing something. <laughs> ah. Okay. Well. I haven't got any feedback going on at the moment, but. Uh, See meters going. <laughs> Just gonna set up the other one. Put that one on there. There you go. There's the other one. Something's missing. That's pretty. That's pretty good image though. I was gonna put the light on, but uh, doesn't look like we need the light on that, does it? Yeah. Pretty good. Okay, carry on. <laughs> okay, we're doing the full chords again. So I thought we'll uh, do some more music for you guys. I'll switch the light off at the camera at the top to give a better image. And it, that looks quite nice actually.
a little bit of the old uh, clean, what was that one? Small rock, well that's the actual the sound on that one. So we've got clean, clean guitar on here. But what we've done is uh, doubled it up and I've actually put a, another layer on to give another full chord that also follows with the bass. I mean, they shouldn't really do that normally, <laughs> but uh, but you can program it to do that if you know how. <laughs> so what I've done is basically I've, I've took that layer there, the keyboards, where they usually split there, and give it a full range, and then put another little layer on top, just to give that a little bit more depth. And it, it goes quite nicely, that does. I could actually do it on these and all, because I can run the next layer on this one and all. Let's have a look. If we take that one off that one back on and we put that into full range chords but what we'll do is I'll change that one back into a different beat take that to an ambience and press the one touch button on this one I want the wrong button <laughs> get the right one get the right one go on okay full range chords Ambience number one three, that's it. Ambience three, quite a nice beat. Quite a nice beat. Okay, we'll bring that one into one finger chord. Now I should have another layer on top, and I should be able to give them full range here. So you notice the actual uh, chords are running exactly with the bass. Well, normally that wouldn't happen, <laughs> but you can actually do that with these keyboards, I've found out. That's a quite a nice sloping pattern there. Yeah, got it on the full range. Nice spicy one.
<laughs> Amazing. As I say, you can get anything with these things, they're weird. <laughs> Synthesizers, absolutely love them. Oh, I like that. Got a bit of a... Oh, it's got one of them. <laughs> Interesting. Let's do a full range chord on this one and all.
Uh, there's some real weird sounds on this thing, I tell you. Uh, I found them the other day. I, I don't know what they were. I just press buttons. <laughs> hi, Colin. How you doing? Jason. Hi. And Neil. Hello, mate. How's it going? Hope you're well. Oh, dear. Took me about half an hour to set this thing up. For some reason, it took me out. It didn't, it didn't like my uh, password for Facebook for some reason. It just changed it. All of a sudden, it changed it. Like that. Weird. So then we had to go through all the usual bits and bobs like, what's your password, what's your name, what's this, what's that. Send your thing back to your phone. Oh dear me, what a game. <laughs> Never mind. Have you enjoyed my new single? Um, there's a sing in there like. And uh, incidentally, if anyone wants one of these mics, there's a good mic for you, Neil. My studio mic, I'm selling the studio mic if you're interested. To my friends, you can have it for 100. It's probably worth 400, but uh, it's in the way at the moment. Um, 100 pound, you can have it. It's got a cable, as you can see. Hang on. Whoops, let me change the camera. You might be able to see it then. Okay, well, this is the one I used to use from the studio. And I've custom made it, so you've got your studio mic here, which is probably a couple hundred quid itself. A cable, nice big sort of... Um, weight on the bottom there to stop that falling over and even the soundproof booth um that was about 50 quid i think that one so yeah anyone wants 100 quid all you gotta do is plug that bit in <laughs> plug that bit in your studio in your mixer and you're away studio mic you'd sound real good through there i tell you mate go for it neil eh? <laughs> get in touch with me tomorrow 100 quid you can take it away <laughs> uh, it's not something i need <laughs> Because I uh, have, a, I just use normal mics now to manipulate my voice if I need to, but uh, mostly it's keyboards anyway, so <laughs> it's something I don't do. And if I do sing on there, I usually get copyrights left, right, and centre. So um, if I sang it shit, I, this is the daftest thing. If I sang it badly, they wouldn't be on my back. But because I sing it quite well, They give me copyrights every time, so then I have to go through all this lot to try and edit it and all that, you know, before I can actually get it onto a um, a website. It's it's just getting a pain in the arse now, so I don't do the bits now. I save save my karaoke stuff for the care homes, and uh, that's the sort of thing I do. Da, 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 da. There you go, down at that ball line bush. <laughs> And the stuff on here yeah, we've got. Uh, what do we do? We do roll that barrel, we do glorious beer, we down the pollen bush, obviously. Um, my old man's a dustman. Oh, what do I sing? I sing this one. Um, don't dilly dally. Mother Kelly's doorstep. Um, it's quite a lot, actually. Um, what I do is do an hour session at these care rooms. I basically do half hour of that, which is some of that stuff, um, on my karaoke machine thingy there over there. Um, and basically half hour of keyboard. So I take a keyboard in with me, plug it into that thing over there. <laughs> Saying that thing over there. There you go, that, that this thing here. It's got a it's a mini karaoke machine like and the take that into care rooms. It's also an amplifier. It's pretty cool. Really, really cool. Um, and it also works on a battery. Um, very, very clever. Um, and uh, basically, you charge 85 quid for that. And uh, yeah, just do an hour. But obviously, if they want a bit more, they'll stay a bit longer. So, uh, so yeah, we're getting the food bookings now and start to go back to them. And also, the discos. The discos come out, yes. But I'm only doing 60s, 70s, 80s. And uh, and it's a premium price and all, it is still the same price. I thought, well, £85, people are paying that, so I'll, uh, I'll do £85 an hour. <laughs> um, it is a high price, but I've done it for years and years and years, and uh, I usually give a good night, so if you want a good night, it's me. <laughs> I like that. That nearly talked, didn't it? Yeah, that's cool, I like that. Just 
just catch that in between the second and third note. And get it to talk. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, I'm not getting carried away again. <laughs> yeah, so there you go. Um, check out all Bandcamp, I've got all my stuff on and I keep adding to it. Um, I was going to go on, um, I, I, I had to laugh at this actually, I, I was going to go um, and get a, f um, a pro license on um, SoundCloud, start putting my music all on there. And uh, I thought, well, okay, we'll look into it. I thought, yeah, okay, £10 a month, um, okay, well, right. Um, but I couldn't believe they had the audacity to actually charge me another, what was it, another uh, £10 a month to actually have a code to actually, so, so you've, you've bought your £10 a month for um, your pro code on, the, on the, um, SoundCloud, because um, I had the normal one. Um, but uh, I thought, well, I'll, I'll do the, the pro one. And I thought, okay, yeah, okay, da, 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 da. But then there was a clause in there, like saying that, yes, you fill this bit in, but you've also got to have a two code system. And believe it or not, you've got to pay this currently here to get your two code system. I thought, well, that's a bit of a bugger. I've just paid all that. So I says, hang on a minute. I'm not going to go and do it, pay it twice, and then also pay another company. So I told them to stuff it, stick it up your arse, mate. No, you, <laughs> there's no way I'm doing that. So uh, I'm not going to bother with the pro. I'm just going to carry on with the, the simple one, which is the free one. Um, since they were being greedy on that. Um, just look into that, guys. If you're going to go on uh, SoundCloud, when you're thinking of the pro, be very careful because they try and charge you with another company to have two second passwords. And... Uh, yeah, I, I didn't think a lot of that. I thought, no, that's that's not wrong. You, not right. You've you've actually charged for being to upgrade on SoundCloud, um, and now you want a, another company to you upgrade and then pay them another load of money for a, a year or something or other, so you can have two passwords, which you don't bloody need anyway in the first place. If you have if you have a good enough password before, you don't need one. But they were saying, you've got to have this password, otherwise you can't get the stuff that you've done by upgrading to Pro. I said, you're a con artist, mate. There's no bloody way I'm doing that. So, uh, so no. <laughs> so, no, I'm just normal. On the, I'm just going to put some, a few mood, mood bits of songs on the SoundCloud. Um, yeah, if you want me to check out any of these companies, you let me know, because I'll soon check them out. And I'll tell you what, if they're wrong, I'll bloody well tell them and all. There's, there's too many people trying to swindle people, even the musicians, they're, they're, they're all right. It, it, us musicians, we're trying to make the money and uh, make a good, some sounds for some people, but there's companies out there that try and, try and do it. I, you know, I can't believe it, you, you're actually paying one company to upgrade, okay? But then they're saying that you can't mon monetize your music if you don't up, go to this company and get two passwords. Now, what the hell do you want two passwords for? You could get away with that. But then they apply in their, in their little tiny bits of words in there, like, they said that, oh, no, you've got to go through this company. Well, that's going to cost you another £10 a month. I says, it's not needed. Why, why do it? Oh, well, you know, oh, well, you can stick up your ass, mate. No way. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. It's not needed, and I don't think I'll bother monetizing with that SoundCloud. Because um, all I'll do is I'll just link it straight off to eBay or um, link it off to uh, Bandcamp, where I sell my music anyway. It was only just to try and get some more, uh, inf lots of music for a lot more fans. But because uh, they a lot more, a load of fans kept saying, "Can you get your music on SoundCloud?" Because I got SoundCloud. I said, "Yeah, I can put my sound." I says, I've got a lot of music to put on SoundCloud, but I'd have to upgrade to a pro. And that's where the problems all started. So I says, no, I'll just do the odd ones. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, up, Colin. How's it going? All right. Yeah, well, there you go. Right. Ooh. Ha, <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> I do like that. I wonder what that one is actually. Let's just uh, do a bit of. Uh, I'm going to put one finger chord on that one, so it resets everything. This this bottom keyboard to the section. Interesting. Right. What we'll do now is we'll loop this one back. We'll put and we'll split this keyboard now. We'll take it down to here and and split that off here. So it brings up the full bass. That's a different one, isn't it? I should say the splits here. That is weird. I've never heard that go like that before.
Whoa. But the old weird stuff there. <laughs> weird stuff coming up. Oh. That's better. Bit of orange and pulling up a lot of lemonade. <laughs> so, yeah. Hang on, where are we? Change camera. Hello. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. See what we got. I like that, that's nice, isn't it? It's got some weird sounds, I tell you. One finger chord.
That was a polka, apparently. That was that was one of them polka things. Kind of weird. Kind of weird. All good fun though. Let's have a look. What's that one? Piano. Okay. Strings. Well, that. Mmm. I feel a waltz. Let's have the strings. That's level. <laughs> Which one you go? <laughs>
<laughs> Last night at the proms. <laughs> no, I won't do that one. <laughs> okay. Gosh, it's gone quick. Um, Apologise for the half hour start. Um, it just chucked me out for some reason. Didn't want the password. No, no, don't want that password. No, don't want that password. I thought, oh, here we go. <laughs> so uh, it was a slow start. And yet, in the afternoon, it was going perfectly. Typical that, isn't it? Eh? Electronics, don't you just love them? Okay. Oh, oh, hang on. <laughs> Hit the right button. <laughs> I think of having more cameras in the room, but I'm not quite so sure. I'm having a job to keep catch them all. I'm having a job to catch all of these. Oh, I've still got this one going all. Going. <laughs> yeah, something's moving. <laughs> something's going. That's my little cork. That is brilliant, this is. In case you haven't seen it, this is fantastic. This, this bit of kit. There you go, look at that. <laughs> it sits up on there and it, it does all weird and wonderful things. I can't hear that, but uh, if I turn the monitor on, I would, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> and if you put that on there, it's brilliant. Download it from Korg, Korg Kronos. It's absolutely free, and I'll have it sticking up there, and then I can play it from there. <laughs> oh, well, back to the... 30-year-old keyboard instead of the 45 synthesizers. Okay. What are we going to do? We'll hang the glue. We'll go on a little bit longer, but not long. That does sound nice. See what rhythm we got to that. Interesting, let's change that to that. And we'll take a full. Uh, I'm quite getting into this uh, full piano finger chord systems. Let's change this over to here. Normally I don't change these things around. But, but we'll go here, I think.
<laughs> just imagine that. Two armies facing each other, having a battle, and then fading into the distance. Oh dear. Yeah, it's amazing. amazing what you can do with your imagination. Just let it go and let these things do what they want. <laughs> nice sound though. And that's what happens when you double up um, your chords on the full range. Um, so if we take it back to the normal finger chords, so basically what I'm talking about is, is um, on some keyboards you get one finger chords, do, 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 where you can actually get the chords to match on your one finger, or you can do a finger chord, which I use, four, four, four fingers, and then there's another mode that some keyboards have, some don't, and that's called pianist. And what that does is that changes all the sounds all the way across the keyboards to full range chords. So you could do it here. And even down here. <laughs> so, um, everything matches pretty well, and you can, uh, you can do a full chord here, and I can do your melodies on top here, or you could probably do your melodies back here, I don't know, I've never tried that. <laughs> First time I've done that, I actually crossed my fingers. Uh, play, play the actual chords on the high range and melody on the low, which is normally not possible. <laughs> I wonder if we can do that with the rhythm. Let's have a look. So if we go... I'd have to change that to there.
first. Okay, well, it's uh, coming up to uh, 15 minutes to go. I think we'll finish off the disco stuff for you guys. Thanks for joining me. I see there's loads on there. I can't see the phone from here, but... Hi, Jason, Colin, Jeff, uh, Martin, Rob, another Rob. Um, there's loads more in there. <laughs> yeah, that was an interesting one, wasn't it? I've never actually played a keyboard cross-handed. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible, actually. In theory, apparently not. <laughs> but, and like they say, everyone says I'm an alien. But yes, I, in case you don't know who I am, my name is Steve Francis. I am a professional keyboard player, but I've never had a listening in my life. I can't read music. I hum the tune in my head. I am playing 432, which is that lovely frequency you hear. Not 440, which is a horrible, harsh frequency you hear. 
which the Rockfords wanted in, back in the 60s, and they still got. But everyone still tunes it to 440, which is wrong. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. <laughs> mm, what we've done at the moment is doubled up all the chords, and I've put, I've chord, put the chords in there, put the chords in there. So if you do a chord here, the bass brings into it. And if you do a chord back here, everything runs to it. But I have gave it on the finger, so if that's, that's how I can do that. <laughs> okay, let's get it back to normal then. Back to fingers. Take the chords off. Take the, bring that one back there. Take that one over there. Bring that over there. And if I hit the MST star, we should now have everything back in order. And one, there you go. So if I hit this one here now. And if I go over to, where has it gone? Lost it now. Yep, uh, 15 minutes, gonna make that. Uh, we'll finish off with a food in 15 minutes then. A little bit louder, but not so much too loud. Actually, we'll do this one, Apache. change a chord there.
<laughs> Playing with the two lower chords there. Okay, coming up to the end then, we're going to do a few of There's a few favourites that uh, everyone keeps asking every week. This is one of them. This is a bit of Caroline.
<laughs> there you go, guys. Well, um, yeah, all live. All as we think about it. Okay, guys. Well, thank you very much for joining me. It's been great. Um, sorry about for the start. Bit of a problem, that one. I uh, don't quite know what happened there. It seemed to lock me out for some reason. <laughs> Strange. There you go. Anyway, sounds like it's thundering outside, isn't it? God, blimey. Okay, guys. Well, take care. Um, thank you very much. I will see you soon. If anyone wants to buy one of these. Bargain of the century. This is my studio mic. Yeah, it probably would have cost about five hundred pounds. <laughs> got a stand on it, got a thing on it, even got one of these. But I'm only one hundred quid for it. So if you want one of these? Come and get it. <laughs> okay. See you soon.